Let's do it. What's up, JD Aliens? I'm back. <laughs> yeah, I'm back again with another video. And in this video, we're gonna be talking about the Tauner TC-777 777s. Look at this, man. Triple sevens. You know that like when you're at the casino hitting them slots, triple sevens means it's gonna be all good. Okay, so this microphone, I'm expecting a lot from this microphone. This is a USB condenser microphone, man. And the reason I wanted to uh, check it out with you guys is because I know a lot of people are starting YouTube channels and doing podcasts and stuff. And great microphones are hard to come by, especially at a reasonable budget. This one comes with a two year warranty on the box. And uh, we're just gonna check it out, see what the hardware looks like, and uh, see how it sounds right on camera. I'm not gonna go into any of the super technical specs because I'm not that type of guy. If you want like super technical specs with numbers and words you don't understand, go somewhere else because <laughs> I'm not gonna be doing that. But I will tell you, it is a polar pattern cardioid, meaning that it only picks up sound from one direction and that's like the front of the microphone so when you talk into it you'll get that deep nice radio rich voice that you might want so let's just go ahead and open this thing up let me bring out my knife man this this my buddy mr meat here you see that yeah you see that oh, i know i know he gets all excited when it's time to open up products but you know this one it's just two slices man so he ain't about to go ham on this one let's get it open yeah don't you love it when you open a box for the first time and it makes that pop sound and then you you smell the product oh god yeah man what's that smell y'all know what that smell is that's that new stuff smell hashtag new stuff in the comment section if you're ready to keep going man let's go all right so here's the microphone oh we get a pop filter here Yep, we get your pop filter. You know what, in my last video, I called this a windscreen. Yes, it could be considered a windscreen, but it's it's called a pop filter. And this one is robust. It's got a thick frame to it. That's kind of nice, man. I ain't never seen one that thick before. All right, ooh. Now this mic is a lot smaller than I thought it would be, but it is a beautiful microphone. Look at this, man. Okay, Tauner, y'all y'all acting up. Now, let's put the box over there. Okay, you got your service card for your two-year warranty, instruction manual. I may or might not need this. I've worked with mics before. Then you got a, 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 a foam filter here or the screen here. Oh, wow. Okay, so everything just kind of comes already put together as a unit. You got a shock mount here, wow. I did not expect all this to be put together like this. All right, let's just take it apart so we can kind of show you what all the hardware looks like. So you got, <laughs> you got your USB microphone. All right, so this looks like it would be metal, but this is actually plastic, a good quality plastic at that. Then you got your microphone part right there, Tana branding, and then you have your, um, your stand with these tripod legs on it and they do lock out. Okay, nice to have that. But then you also have a shock mount. You, man, to get a shock mount, I'm, I'm still impressed by the shock mount. To get a shock mount, shock mounts are usually extra. Like it's a separate purchase. They usually just sell you the mic by itself, possibly a pop filter or a screen, but the shock mount is always extra. This is value right here. Now all you gotta do if you pop a rubber band is just get another one. It's like either a rubber band or a, an O-ring if you want to. But what I did notice is that the USB cable is not detachable. So, you know, be careful with this because once it's gone, you're, you're done. You can't just be unplugging this thing and then plugging it back up. But on the opposite end, what we have is a USB-A uh, input right here or output, whichever end you're going from. And uh, yeah, let's get this thing put together. Okay, so I've got the microphone all put together and I'm ready to test it out on camera with you guys. But I wanted to show you what it looks like. Let's pull back a little bit. I want to show you what it looks like put together, assembled correctly. So you do have a tilt here, so you can kind of tilt it in front of your face as you're talking. And you do have this pop filter, which comes with it. And it's got this little snake deal right here where you can just kind of adjust it however you need to. And it's all attached onto the mount, the shock mount that's included. That is super nice, man. I, I dig it. I really, really do. And then we're not going to use this. I'm going to just use the, the, um, the pop filter right here. So in order to test this thing out, you can't just plug it directly into your camera. You gotta have a PC, right? Cause you gotta plug it in via USB. So let's just pull out my trusty 
PC right here, or my laptop rather, just to see how much of a plug and play microphone this is. So let me get this bad boy fired up. We'll plug it in, do some recording, and you'll hear the audio directly from the mic. Okay, get your eyeballs in here. I've got my voice recorder right there, and then I'm going to plug this in the side right here on my, U oh, that's USB-C. It's on this side. This is my USB-A input, so I'll plug it in, and you'll hear some type of sound. There it is. I don't know if you heard it or not. All right. It says setting up Tonner TC-777. I know this is at a tilt angle, but I want to give you kind of a bird's eye view of what we're doing here. So it is literally plug and play. I wonder, is it ready? Let me see here. I, I think it's ready, man. So let's go ahead and um, let's go ahead and hit record and testing, testing, testing. Let me. Oh yeah, that's recording, okay. Wait a minute, it was recording and I was just tapping on the thing. All right, so this is what it sounds like uh, in real time, I guess. You know, it's not necessarily real, real time since this is an upload versus a live stream. But yes, you can use this for live streaming and uh, recording a podcast. Okay, it just told me that the device is ready, but it's already picking up all the audio. So this is exactly what it sounds like. Just plug and play no adjustments i'm not gonna um i'm not gonna adjust this thing in post during my editing process but i want you to tell i want you to hear why you need a um a pop filter here so when i say pop 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 with the pop filter on it it sounds like that but if i take away the pop filter and i say pop 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 it might peak out so Remember, when you're recording your podcast or your gaming voiceovers or whatever you're going to be doing, make sure you put that pop filter on there, man. Not only do you prevent yourself from spitting and saturating your microphone, you also reduce those plosives. Look, man, I am no expert in this kind of stuff, but I'm just going to assume that this mic is working because I can see the, the voice thing. You know, it's, it's recording, so I hope it's working out. If you enjoyed this video and if you like the sound of this microphone, go ahead and throw me some emoji hands up in the comment section. But that's it. I got to get out of here and go make some more videos. But until we see each other again, make sure y'all keep being good together. And I'll see y'all at the next upload. Oh, so you wanted them cats that like to just run up in a place, take what you want, then leave, huh? Man, you better hit that subscribe and notification button. That way, you know when I'm over here opening up new stuff. And while you're down there, you might want to consider tapping that uh, join button and becoming a member because membership has its perks. See, that wasn't so bad. All right, man, I appreciate you. And I'll see you at the next one. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?